your friends in their aggressive anti-Russian policies, the West has crossed the line. We keep hearing threats against our country, against our people. Certain irresponsible politicians from the West, they don't just say about their plans to supply long-range assault weapons to Ukraine systems that would allow them to strike Crimea and other regions of Russia. Such terrorist attacks, including using the Western weapons, are also used against the Belgorod and Kursk regions using the contemporary systems, aviation, satellites, strategic unmanned aerial vehicles. And NATO is performing reconnaissance across the entire Russian border. In Washington, London, Brussels, they push Kyiv to try to move the hostilities to our territories. They don't even hide it when they are saying that Russia should be destroyed at the field of battle and they should deprive us of any kind of sovereignty. They should rob our country of everything. They have started nuclear blackmail. I'm not only talking about the attacks against Zaporozhye nuclear power station that is promoted by the Western creators, but I'm talking about the statements about high-level representatives of the NATO countries about the possibility of using weapons of mass destruction against Russia, nuclear weapons. And those who make such statements against Russia, I would like to remind them that our country also possesses various type of like, weapons. And in some components, we have more modern weapons than NATO countries. And if the territorial integrity of our country is threatened to defend and protect our country and our people, we will use all the means that we have. And I'm not bluffing. The citizens of Russia can be confident that we will defend the territorial integrity and sovereignty of our country. And I would like to emphasize it with any means that we have in our possession. And those who are trying to blackmail as with nuclear weapons. I would like to remind them that the wind can blow towards them as well. In the destiny of our people, it is to stop those who want to dominate the world, who want to enslave our homeland, our fatherland. And we will do that now as well. That's how it will happen. I trust in your support.